rules of every day. It's your kingdom, Lord. And the days of your children, right? And the land which the Lord swear unto your... And the land, right? The land, they talk about the kingdom. I could pepper that one. He said, and the land, go on. Which the Lord swear unto your fathers to give them. Right? That's Israel. Go on. As the days of heaven. The what? As, as the, the days of heaven. As the days of heaven. Upon the earth. Of what? Upon, upon the, the earth. earth. Our days of heaven going to be upon the earth. That's right. Bring that out, King. Okay. Lamentations. Two and one. Two and one. Chapter 2, verse 1. Bro. The book I of chapter here. 2, and verse 1. Bring it out. Bring it out. How have the Lord covered the daughter of Zion with a cloud in his anger right. and cast down? He said, from, cast down from what? From heaven. We said the daughters of Zion was cast down from heaven. Right. There's nowhere in the scriptures that we was up here with the most high was dwelling at, right? Right. Go on and say, we was cast down from heaven unto the earth. That means un rulership unto the earth. That's Captivity, right. brother. Go on. The beauty of Israel. The beauty of what? Of, of Israel. Israel. Right. The most high cast us down from heaven, from rulership. When you read the book of Kings, guess what? That's rulership. Brother, that's, 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 that's uh, King Solomon, King right. David, right? You got uh, all these different kings. That we was in rulership, right. brother. That's yeah. our heaven on earth. You got your iPhone. And remember not his footstool. In the day of his oh, anger. Yeah. Alright, so hold on. We got one more. This is the book of Matthew, chapter 6, and verse 9. Right? Oh. After this manner, therefore pray ye, yes. our Father. Yes. This, this is the prayer, right? Which are in, in heaven. heaven. Are in heaven going. Hallowed be thy, thy name, right? Thy, thy kingdom come. come. Thy will be done. Thy will be done. Thy kingdom come. Thy kingdom, kingdom come. come. Thy, thy will be done. done. So the most I said, His will is going to be done. That kingdom is going to come, right? Not going to be up there in the dirt heaven. Right. Be here. That right. That kingdom is going to come. That will be done. Go on. That will be done in earth. What? In, in earth. earth. Uh -huh. As it is in heaven. As it is. Like the kingdom is going to be like most high dwells up in the dirt heaven. It's going to be the same way in here. That's right. Right. So that's that's a prayer, brother, that our kingdom is going to come to oh, into here. So let's get about hell. Isaiah 5 13. The book of Isaiah. Chapter 5, verse 13. If you don't know, brother, right now, we are living in hell. Right now. Oh, right? Oh, being oppressed, right. being chained, being whipped, God. getting killed in the streets. Brother, that's hell, brother. That's right. right. Go on. Read. Therefore, my people are going Joel, into captivity because they have no knowledge. Right. They said they have no knowledge. That put people going through captivity. Go on. And the multitude dried up with thirst. Read. Therefore. Hell hath enlarged Therefore herself. What? Therefore, hell, hell hath enlarged herself. Therefore, hell hath enlarged herself. Because captivity, brother, we disobeyed the most side. This is this is hell right now. That's, that's right. 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 This we live in the hell, brother. Had to work nine to five, brother. That's hell, brother. You think working is, is, is the way of life? No, our way of life has been rulers, been kings and priests, man. Right. That's 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 how hell. Brother, that is hell, brother. That's right. So when I people say, you. "Oh, you're going to die," yeah, but you got to pay the bills, brother. Exactly. It's a different time. That's hell, brother. Being oppressed in another man's land. That's hell, right? We have to repent from from from, from all these days to get the kingdom, to That's get right. heaven upon earth, man. Right. You can't be dwelling here forever, man. It's not going to happen. That's right. Either you in or you out, brother. That's right. You got to repent and keep and keep the commandments, man. This this not no. We're not bringing this thing out for our own good, brother. We teaching you. So you might know who you are, so you can get the kingdom of heaven with us, brother. That's right. That's right. See, That's right. We, we want to see you in the same table, eat with us, brother, in the kingdom of heaven. That's, That's right. right. See, you want to go to your crib and see your service, brother. That's right. right. Like, like the same yeah, thing man. you want us, man. You, you want you want to be you want to be free, brother. You want to have you want to have a kingdom, brother. Right. You want to have service under you, brother. That's 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 heaven. All right. Been to hell. It's been oppressed, man. Bring that out. It's the book of Job. Chapter 36 and 35, verse 35 and 9. Verse 35, chapter 35 and verse 9. Bring it out. By reason of the multitude right. of oppressions. Oh, oppression, go on. They make the oppressed to cry. They make the who? They, they make, make the, the oppressed, oppressed to cry. Who's getting oppressed, brother? Who's out here crying and signing all day long, man? Right. Who out here marching justice, peace, justice, peace, man? They make the oppressed to cry, right? They want... We out there, we get killed, man, by these wicked police, man, every single day, brother. 
may not be on the news, may not be on camera, man, it's happening, brother. Right. We out here getting licks every single day, man. Right. It may not be on the news, it may not be out there in the world, people might not see it, but it's happening, brother. Right. Right, behind your eyes or whatever, brother, it's, it's happening. Day or night, our people is signing crime. Right. Right, there been no press. We, we, Come. They cry out by reason of the arm of the mighty. Right, by the reason of the arm of the mighty. Man. Right. But none saith, where? where is God, my maker? But no, no one asks, hey, look, why these things happen to us? Why the most high is not saving us? Right? They said, no, nobody asks, look, where, where is God, our maker? Right? Because our maker wants you to repent. Right? Go on. Who give him songs in the night? Right? Who give him songs in the night? Man, you rest right there. So, look, our people crying right now, being no press. In these streets, give me Psalm chapter 10, verse 8. We, we, we got. Book of Psalm chapter 55 and verse 3. Bring right? it out. Because of the voice of the enemy, uh -huh. because of the oppression of the wicked. Of the oppression of the wicked, brother. Who is the wicked? The so-called white man, right? He continues to oppress us day in and day out, brother. Go on. For they cast iniquity upon me. They cast what? Iniquity, iniquity upon, upon me. me. And in wrath, they hate me. In wrath, they what? They hate, they hate me. me. You think the so-called white man hate us and love us? No, nah, man, you found us there. They hate us, brother. That's right. Right. They hide your nationality away from you, brother, on purpose. So you don't know who you are. That's right. Right? They want you to dwell in this sin because when they when we continue in sin, they have dominion over us. Right? They continue to rule over us because we still in sin. Right. Most high continue to chastise us, chastise us because we are continuing in sin, brother. Read what you got. Okay. Psalms 10 to 8. This is the book of Psalms, chapter 10. And verse 8, read, he sitteth in the lurking places of the villages. Who sit in the lurking places, man? So-called white man. Police, they hide in little cars, whatever. They walk up and down the street. You know, they waiting, they waiting for us to make a move. They waiting for us to do something stupid or whatever so they can lock us up, they can kill us, they can do whatever they want. Right. They want. In the secret places, that he, he murder the, the innocent. innocent. What? That, that he, he murder the innocent. They murder the innocent. Come on, we're going. Oh, God, go ahead. His eyes are privately set, set against, against the poor. poor. His what? His eyes are privately set, set against, against the, the poor. poor. We the poor, man. We, we, the, we, we, we the one that got to depend on the so-called white man right. to live, brother. Right. To, to, make our, to make ends meet, to get a job, to pay your rent, to pay your car note. Right, the the, the, the uh, they put our, uh, our our kids in schools, brother. We we the one that been oppressed, man. Give me Deuteronomy chapter chapter uh, twenty and sixty six. All right, let me keep going. Oh, on. oh go ahead. Go ahead. Yeah, battery, brother. Verse go ahead. nine. He lieth in wait secretly, right. as a lion in his den. Right, and he lieth in wait secretly, man, waiting for us to slip. Go on. He lieth in wait. To catch the poor. Right, they what? To, to catch, catch the, the poor. poor. That's why a lot of people is in prison houses right now. Give me Isaiah 42, man, 22. Bring it out. A lot of people is in prison houses right now, man. Hey, you can bring that up. Go ahead. He does catch the poor when, when he, he draws, draws him out into his, his net. net. Right. That, a net is what? A net to catch somebody. Right? That's right. Like, go, oh, I got him. I got this nigga. You know, oh, bring him back. Bro, that's, that's, who does that, man? The so-called white man. Right, they oppress the poor every single day, man. Give me that. Uh, you can right there. This is Zechariah chapter 11 and verse 5. Right. Right? Oh, whose possessors slay them? Who what? Who whose possessors, possessors slay, slay them? them? Who getting slayed, man? Every day, brother. We are, brother. Go on. And, and hold, hold themselves, themselves not guilty. guilty. And they what? And, and hold, hold themselves, themselves not guilty. That's why there's no justice, man. No justice for Betty Gray. No justice for uh, uh, Orlando Castile. Philando. Or Philando Castile, Slotia, like or right, Ghana, you know, and all these different other people that got that get, they got shot down in these streets, man, by the so called white man. Right. They said they hold themselves not guilty. Lord. And they shall say, Blessed be the Lord, for I am rich, right? And their their own shepherd pity them, them not. I, we got we have no savior. We have no savior, man. No black leaders, what that so-called black leaders to to out here that right. that can uh, give us justice, man. Right? You respect that. Give me uh print that, okay? Give me. Book of Deuteronomy, chapter twenty-eight and verse sixty-six. Right. And thy life shall hang in doubt. He said, our life shall hang in doubt, Lord. Before thee, and thou shalt fear, fear day, day and night. night. We shall fear day and night, brother. That's been no press, brother. We fear day or night. Our life is. 
is we don't know if we're gonna make it through the day. We don't know if we're gonna make it to the night. Right. Make it shot down. People get shot down five o'clock in the morning. Right. Oh. Right. Right. Six o'clock in the oh. morning. People get shot down all day on the news, man. That's right. Going. And shall have none assurance of thy life. Have none assurance of our life, man. We don't know. Look. We can't have no assurance of our life, brother. That's right. We, we can get killed any day. Any, we, have to, we can kill any day, man. And what are we going to do about it? Nothing. God, God right? do. Nothing we can do about it. Our family can't get justice. Our family can't get nothing, man. We can rush right there and bring that out. The book of Isaiah, chapter 42, verse 22. Bring right. it out. But this is a people robbed and spoiled. Go on. They are all snared. Uh, they are all, of, are all of them snared in holes. Uh huh. And they are hid. In prison houses. houses. We are here in prison houses, brother. That's right. Why are we here in prison houses? Because the so-called white man set the, the drugs in our neighborhood. That's right. right? Our, our people can't even get a job. What do you do? They set the drugs in the neighborhood and look, let these, let these people uh, 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 oppress each, uh, each other. Oh, real, man. Right. Put the guns in the neighborhood. Who put these guns in the neighborhood? We're not putting these guns in the neighborhood. Right. Who put these guns in the neighborhood? We're not going overseas to put these, uh, to, to put these uh, drugs in our neighborhood. Right. Like, they, they press us, they can pack us up in one little area, and they put guns and drugs. For what? Kill each other? Right? They put, they put, we, got, we live in a poverty, right? Everybody fighting over money. Everybody fighting over corners, man. Like, our people out there killing each other for no reason, man, because the white man wants you to do that. And that's called white supremacy, brother. Right. If you don't know, white supremacy is everywhere, brother. Because our people hate their prison houses, man. And that's it on that. They are for a prey. For a prey, brother. And none deliver it. And none delivers. None can save us. You rest right there. Go ahead. Bring that out. It's the book of Ecclesiastes, chapter 8, and verse 8. Five. Bring it out. And verse 5. Whoso keepeth the commandment shall feel no evil thing. Right. And a wise man hunt. The son of both time and judgment. So this is the time that we got to think about it, man. Right? It said, whoso fear, it's like to read that again. Oh, whoso keepeth the commandment uh -huh. shall feel no evil thing. Right, we got to feel no evil thing, bro. Go on. And a wise man's heart. Right. The son of both time and judgment. Right, we got to discern times and judgment. That's right. how we live in it. Right? The judgment set upon the earth. And give me uh, five and eight. Right? So it's the time we living in, man, it's time to wake up, man. It's time to get out of this captivity. Go on. Do that. Book of Ecclesiastes chapter five, 5 and verse 8. Bring it out. If thou seest the oppression of the poor. Right, if you see your oppression of the poor, right, that means what? We getting pressed. We getting oppressed on these streets, man. We getting shot down, right? We getting false, falsely judged. Go on. And violent perverting of judgment. Now, what does that mean? Violent perverting of judgment, man. Our people get, we got no justice out here, right? You, you get you get caught for a little bit of bag of weed and you get ten years in prison, man. Right. So called white man, he 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 could uh, he he he, got, he he could get out on his own recon, right? Right. A black man killed another uh, a black man. He got like dead in 60, 80 years, man, in jail. A white man killed a black man. What he get like what five months? That's right. Probably get off for early probation. Right. Probably get a year. Pay leave. Hey, pay leave. White man, the white right. the white police can go to the vacation. You know, they still get money. Right. Yes. Those are violent perverting judgment, go on. And justice in a province marvel not at the matter. Right, so no, marvel not at the matter, because you know why? This, this, all these things that's happening because we are under the persecution of the white man because we broke the law of such commandments, man. We broke the yeah, laws, brother. Me. Right? So it's our time to repent. You rest right there. Give me the book of... Um, that's not how I Matter of fact, just give me the book of um, Africa. I slipped my mind. Yeah, it slipped my mind. Just give me the book What's of, the uh, shoot. Oh, no, just okay. give me the piece that you're talking about. It slipped my mind. I can't remember the piece I had. I'm, I'm, I'm getting cold, bro. Oh, yeah, cold. Yeah, bro, we're gonna be out here all day, man. But if you if you if you got <laughs> if you want to leave, brother, you got flies for you, brother. All right, we just we just let people know who we are. Huh? You got a word? Right, brother. We, that's, that, that's, that's been no press, man. Work it, man. Give me the book. That's the key to book. Uh, uh, Y'all don't want no tea. It's kind of cold. Let's bring something in there. We got to slip in mind. Baruch. Baruch. Right? Baruch. 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 Baruch.
it's our day, it's our, it's our land of captivity, man. We said we are yet this day in our captivity, go on. Where thou hast scattered us right. for a reproach and a curse and to be subject to payments. To be what? To be subject, subject to, to payments. payments. We are subject, like you said, bro, you have to work, brother. We are subject to payments, man. We out here got to work nine to five, day in, day out, go serving and slaving for the so-called white man so they can continue to be rich. Right, and we continue to live check, pay, paycheck with paycheck, right? Lent, yeah, we got lint in our pocket. We just got paid the rent, you know. We gotta work. We gotta uh, continue to work, you know. Our children need food. White men, they own everything, brother. Lord, according to all the iniquities of our fathers, which departed from the Lord our God. Y'all going to slavery? That's right. right. That's right. Daughters, brother. That's right. I'm going to slavery, man. Just yeah. like the Lord. Right. So we are subject to payments, brother. That's right. So, like you say, bro, you just came from work, right? Give me Jeremiah chapter 22, verse 13, brother. And look at it. Our people was working in slavery, brother. Getting nothing. Right. Right. Getting nothing, nothing man. That's oppression, brother. Right. But we, we barely made a way out, brother. Go on. It's the book of Jeremiah chapter 22 right. and verse 13. Bring it out. Woe unto him right. that buildeth his house by unrighteousness. Right. The mo he said, woe, I mean, death and destruction to these white men because they built this house unjustly, man. Right. They put the, we, we had to build up America. Right. We had to put, we built these white houses, whatever, what, all these big old properties, whatever they, they stays in now. We built this stuff, man. We That's get, right. We get, got no pity for that. Right. Right. We built these houses and we don't be dwell in them. Go on. And his chambers by Rome. Right, it's all no. It's like yo, we even built all these houses, and we got to pay rent to live in them, brother. I right, gotta, I gotta pay rent to live in the house I built. Right, that's not so pressed, man. Go on. Right, it's they, we, we from the top game slot here. Woe unto him that built of his house right. by unrighteousness, uh -huh. and his chambers by wrong, and his chamber by wrong. Go on. They use of his neighbor's service. Right, uses of service without wages. Without what? Without, without wages. wages. Get a damn penny, man. And give it him not. For his work, we didn't get nothing, man. For the work that we put in, picking cotton, uh, uh, being chest out in the field, we did not get anything for that, brother. So it's our time. It's our time to repent, man. Our time to wake up, and return back to the Lord, brother. Right. All right. You got that? Yeah, yeah brother. So, right. So, brother, you were Israel, brother, from the tribe of right. Judah, brother. That's right. That's right. You know what Christ looked like. You might not know that. You don't. You, you know what Christ looked like. I don't go by that guy. You don't go by that man? No. Why not? Why, why you say he's not real? He's just Well, we ain't talking about that white guy. We talking about the, how it was shot. Right? And the bite. The true Messiah. Right? The true Messiah. Right. Came from you, brother. Came right. from you. Bring right. it out, King. This is the book of Revelation. Revelation. He's our redeemer. He's the one that's killed or jumped down out of his throne and come down and say, what's brother? Once we repent. Read. Revelation chapter 1. In verse 13, Bring it out. and in the midst of the seven candlesticks, one like unto the Son of Man, one. clothed with a garment down to the foot, right. and girt about the pants with a golden girdle. One. His head and his one. hairs one. were white, white like wool. That's not this white guy. It's that our Messiah, his head and hair was white like wool. That's right. All right, who got, who got woolly hair? The so-called white man had woolly hair? Right, so called black man, we have woolly hair. That's right. We have that nappy woolly hair. That's right. Right. Go on. As white as snow. It said, as white as snow. And his eyes were as a flame of fire. And his eyes were flame of fire. Go on. And his feet, right, like unto fine, fine bread. bread. If I look at your feet, it would be the same color as your skin, right? Throughout your, throughout your whole body. It said, his feet like fine bread. You know what bread is? Yeah. Like a remnant of brown, like a penny. This feel like nothing fine brass. As if they burn in a furnace. As if they what? As burn as in a furnace. furnace. Christ is so dark, it's like you got burnt in a furnace. Oh. That's how they compare Christ, man. You're upset. You're, you're Messiah. All right? And his voice, the sound of many waters. And Christ spoke loud, man. He, he, when you read the book of Matthew chapter 13, verse 1, Christ got in a, he got on a, on a sheet, on, on a seashore, and he spoke to thousands of people, man. That's right. How did he do that? Because he spoke loud. Right. He was speaking like a little sissy white man, man. That's right. So I'm a saying, it's like a, I'm a sire, man. It's a so-called black man. And he came for you, and he died for you to give you salvation, man. Give me Matthew chapter 1, verse 21. Yeah. Give me the book of Acts chapter 5, verse 29. Oh, right, bring that out, man. It's the book of Matthew chapter 1. Give, give, me, the book of, give me Matthew chapter 2, verse 6. 
the book of Matthew chapter 1 and verse 21. Right. And see shall bring forth a son, uh -huh. and thou shalt call his name Yahweh Shah. That's right. Shah, go on. For he shall save his people. No, the whole world. He, he shall, shall save, save his people. people. Well, no, John 3, 16 said, God shall love the world. For he, he shall, shall save, save his people. He shall save his people. From their sins. The who's his people? The so-called blacks, Hispanic, and Native Americans, man. The right. tribes of Israel. That's right. That's right. Free that okay. Book of... Matthew. Book of Matthew, chapter 2 and verse 6. Right. And thou, Bethlehem, in the land of Judah, Go on. art not the least among the princes of Judah. Right. For out of thee shall come a governor uh -huh. that shall rule my people, and Christ, Israel. Christ is going to be that so governor to rule his people, Israel. Kill this for me, Uncle. Go on. Then Herod. It's like, it's like it. We know that's what he can understand. For out of thee uh -huh. shall come a governor that shall rule my people, Israel. That rules people, Israel. His people, Israel. Not the whole world. Not the so-called white man. Not the Chinese man. Not the uh, uh, Arab man. But his people, the so-called black and Spanish Native American. His people, man. Israel. Right. Can you write that okay? Give me a uh, look back here. This is the book of Acts, chapter 5, and verse 29. And Peter and the other apostles answered and said, We are to obey God rather than men. We are to obey who? God rather than men. The God of our fathers raised up Yahweh Shah. He said, The God of our fathers, right? Not the whole world. That's a possession, man. Our father. Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, the one whom ye slew and hang on a tree. They slew that. They, they just slew that white man. They slew Yahweh Shah. Right. The black Messiah, go on. Right. Hey, Him. Hey, it's like it's a hang on a tree, brother. They was doing, doing in, in, in Rome, they, was, they had a the, uh, crucifixion, right? You get, you know, you get nails in the hands and in the legs or whatever. So called Babylon, America, they get hang on a tree, man. About the same thing. Right. You say you slew and hang on a tree, go on. Verse 31. Him hath God exalted with his right hand right. to be a prince. To be a what? To be yeah, a right. prince uh -huh. and a savior for to give repentance to, to Israel. Israel. To be to give repentance to Israel, brother. Right? So Christ, he came for you, man. He's a, he's a black man. Not a so-called white man with stringy hair that speaks softly as inside these wicked churches, man, telling you you can do whatever you want to do. Man, our Messiah, he set rules. Give me the book of uh the book of Luke chapter 11, verse 13. Look, and forgiveness of sin. Forgiveness of sin, man. Verse 23. The book of Luke chapter 11. And verse 23. He that is not with me. Christ, right? He's saying, he that is not with me, what? Is against me. If you're not with the, down with the Messiah and you turn it back to him and keep his commandments, he said, "You are against them, man. That's the if you want you you don't want to be on the other side when the time comes. That's right, right? He said, he that is not with me is against me. Go on. And he that gathers not with me scatters. And he that not and he don't he that gather not gather with me. Let me come out here and teach his word. You got to love but scattering the people, right? You ain't teaching just at the Lord. You teaching everything else, man. Read what you got. Book of Luke, chapter nineteen, verse twenty-seven. Read." But those my enemies, but those my enemies, this is Christ speaking, right? He said, but those my enemies, which would not that I should reign over them. Yeah, they didn't want to keep my commandments. They didn't want to do what I, do what I say. What's going to happen? Bring hither. He said, bring hither. Now, this, this is the words of the white man saying this. He said, those right. my enemies that don't want to obey me and, and, and let me rule over them. He said, bring here and what? And slay them, them before me. me. It's so called white man doing that. Right. He, ain't, he ain't speaking like that. That's a that's a black man voice, man. He said, right. Slay right. them right. before me. Go on. And when he had thus spoken, that's there. But he said, if you don't want to obey me, he said, bring them here and slay them before me. Man. That's, right. that's right. So called white man teach him and, and, and speaking like that, man. Right. I don't know, brother, man. So I'm just bringing up to you, brother. We have to repent, believe in the house, uh, right? And come back. This is the book of Zephaniah, chapter 2, 
and verse one. So guess what we gotta do in these last days, brother? We gotta do what? Gather yourselves together. You gotta do what? Gather, gather yourselves, yourselves together. together. We gotta gather ourselves together. Can't be out there being separate, being this a so-called nigga, being this so-called black man, African American. We gotta gather ourselves together as the nation of Israel. That's right. Yay! Gather together, O oh, nation, not desire. All right. You said nation not desire, because who does that, who who the nation that that's, that that look down upon us, man? We are the ones that that's that not desire going. Before the decree bring forth, right? Before the they, day pass as the chain, before the fierce anger of okay, the hour come upon you. Before Mosiah sent his son, we got to get us up together. Before Christ returns, we have to come back and keep this commandment going. Before the day of the hour's anger come upon you. Right. So before the day of wrath, of the uh, 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 the wrath, the Mosiah that comes with the, uh, with the judgment, we have to get us up together and we turn back to his ways as the Israelites. And keep his commandments, right? Right. Read what you got. Revelation 18 and 4. 18 and 4. 4. Book of Revelation, chapter 18 and verse 4. Bring right it up. And I heard another voice from heaven saying, right. Come, Come out, out of her, my, my people. people. Come, out of the, Come out of these nations, man. Come out of these wicked heathen and their doctrines. Come out of your sins, right? That ye be not partakers of her sins, right? And that ye receive not of her plagues. Right. What's her plagues? Death, hell, and destruction. Go on. Right. For her sins have reached unto heaven. Right. Read verse 8. Verse 8. Therefore. These are plagues, brother. Go on. Shall her plagues come, come in one, one day. day. Right. We are loud. We mighty. Death and, and mourning. mourning. Said, what? Death, Death and, and mourning. mourning. Death and mourning come to America. Go on. And famine. And, and famine. Go on. And she shall be utterly burned with right. fire. She's going to be what? Utterly burned with fire. fire. That's right, brother spoke mighty in the spirit. Huh. All praise to the Most High. Right, as the Bible spoke mighty in the spirit, Yahweh has helped, man. Right? Yahweh has helped, man. Right? So brother, you got the information, you got the information. Does everything make sense? I'm listening to y'all, right? I mean, you I can listen, but, but I've been ignorant, right? Well, I'm asking, does it make sense? It, it, of course it may. I wouldn't have sat here. And I would, okay, I would, well, have, I would have, you know, explain this to you. Explain this. All right, brother. Just you ask him, brother, because people come up here and listen. Give me a seat. You're 33. People listen all the time, but they don't hear it. It's being brought up. Huh. So when people <clears> come, <throat> we want people to understand. Uh, it's I understand, brother, that you get it. I kind of was hip, you know, the full, but okay, I made it clear. All praise to the it's the, the book of Ezekiel, chapter 33 and verse 31. Bring it out. And they come unto thee as the people coming. So they come unto thee as the people coming. And they sit before thee as my people. Because a lot of people, they come and they hear the word. They acknowledge that they the Israel. Dumb. They acknowledge who their enemy is. They hear the curse. They go through the whole breakdown. And they say, oh, man, that's, that's cool. Go on. And they hear thy word. And they what? And they hear yeah, thy man. word. Read. But they will not do them. But what? But, but they, they will, will not, not do them. But they will not do them. Read. For with their mouth, they shoot much love. A lot of people, they don't say, man. That's, that makes sense. I get it. Not saying this is directed at you, brother, but this is speaking on past experience that we encounter with our people, man. With their mouth, they show much love. Read. But their heart goes after their covetousness. Right? Meaning they end up doing what they want to do. Ignorance is bliss, right? Yeah, they'll go up there right, and just live life and vanity. Go on. And lo. The art unto them as a very lovely song right. of one that hath a, a pleasant voice and can play well on an instrument. Right. Certain men and women, they'll come up and hear the words of the Lord, and it's like a concert. Huh? They'll bring their kids up, right? When the summertime, they'll have ice cream. You'll see people in the back eating popcorn. You'll, uh, you'll see people taking Titus 1 to 16. Uh, give me James chapter 1 and 22 as well. You'll see people taking pictures, man. It'll be like a concert up here, man. We had one Edomite woman that said, are y'all going to dance for me today, man? Right? Are y'all going to perform for me, man? Yeah, that happened. Yeah, that happened. A so-called white woman said, are y'all Negroes going to dance for me, man? Yeah, yeah, she asked us that, man. Right? So go back to that Ezekiel chapter 33. Come on. Ezekiel chapter... They think because it's a group of so-called black, Hispanic, and Native American men, we're supposed to entertain you, man. Uh -huh. And dance for you and sing the doo man. Uh -huh. right. Like it's the 1940s, man. To hell with that, man. Right. 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 right? We're here to tell you what the Most High said, man. 
Our job is to come out here and strictly tell you what the Heavenly Father is going to do on the earth before it happens. That's and right. if you listen, hey, well, if you don't listen, you're going to be cut down. That's right. right. It ain't nothing no in between. There's no gray area. There's no middle line where you can try to find yourself in limbo. It's either you get down or you lay down in the last days, right? And a lot of our people, they go and lay down, man. And when I say lay down, I mean in the dirt, man. Because they don't want to get down with the Most High's program. That's right. This is the real New World Order coming on the scene, man. Uh -huh. This is the real thing that the Most High's setting up in the last That's days. That's right. The servants, the apostles, the prophets, the teachers, the evangelists, for the perfecting of the saints, man. Read that. And let me get huh. that in Ephesians 4 and 8. Too. Ezekiel chapter 33 and verse 32. Read. And lo, thou art unto them as a very lovely song of one that hath a pleasant voice it can play well on an instrument. Read. For they hear thy words. They hear thy words. But they do them not. Read. And when this coming to pass. And when what? And when, when this coming to pass. pass. That ain't never gonna happen. And, and when, when this coming, coming to pass. pass. When America's destroyed. When all hell break loose. When the famine kick off. When the race wars kicked off. When women getting snatched up. When old white man killing Jake like he's going out of style, man. Huh? When this coming to pass. Lo, it will come. It might not happen. Lo, Lo it, it will, will come. come. Those are old words. Lo, Lo it, it will, will come. come. Said, Look, it will come. Right. Read. Then shall they know that a prophet has been among them. Then they going to know, man. Right. Uh, then you going to know, man. Uh, yeah, yeah. Somebody told me that the damn power was going to go out, man. That's right. And it's going to be a damn race war, man. That's right. And martial law and FEMA camps and guillotines are set up, man. Somebody told me they're going to be going door to door, snatching me up out of my house, man. Confiscating my goods, man. That's and looking right. me to prison, man. Somebody told me it's going to be dead bodies lynched up at the top of these damn lamp posts, man. Somebody told me these things, man. That's right. Right? Because those days are coming on the earth where man is going to do what they want to do, man. And you're not going to be governed by the laws of the society when martial law kick off, That's man. right. Mm. All hell is going to break loose. And if you don't repent, you're going to be caught out there in the destruction. That's, That's right. right. So right. you can't talk about it enough. I'm going to have to come Saturday because I can't come Monday, right? Come, brother. I'm going to come next Saturday. Most I will. No, we would love to see you there, bro. I appreciate you. I'll pray to the most I will. I appreciate you, brother. Shalom. Shalom, brother. Shalom, brother. Shalom, brother. Appreciate you. brother. So the word is going out, man. That's right. Right? We're going to hold you to you, brother. I believe you're a man of your word, brother. Right? So the Lord said, then shall they know that a prophet has been among them. Shalom. 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 Peace, brother. Shalom is peace. Right? So the Lord said, then shall they know that a prophet has been among them. So you're going to have these things happen on the earth, man. Right? When you see everybody walking down and they have their different d uh, duties they got to do, people running errands, people running, they jogging, buying, selling, getting that last minute Christmas shopping in, right. people online ordering from Amazon, they just got a nice deal for damn Cyber Monday, they was in line for Black Friday. Mm. Hey, this is the mentality of the people, man. Right. We brought that out before. Give me, uh, I know we holding up. What you hold? Ephesians, Titus. Yeah, we hold. All right. Give me um, Zephaniah 2 and 15. We okay. brought that out early. R read where you left off. Titus. Come. It's the book of Titus, chapter 1 and verse 16. Hey, Bring it family, out. come here to word, family. Come here to word of God. Come on. Come on, come brother. On, brother. Two minutes, brother. Two minutes. Okay. Two minutes, brother. Hold on, hold on, brother. Hold on. Hey, if you don't repent, brother, you're going to get put to death, man. That's, That's right. 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 See, we're not going to beg you to hear the word of the Lord no more, man. Right. Either you listen or you don't, man. Right, those days, those days are coming to an end, man. That's right. That's right. Either we, either you, you listen to what the Most High is telling you, or you get burnt by the missiles. Man. That's, That's right. right. Right, these days are coming to an end, man. That, that door is closed. The Lord said, "Give me, uh, drop that. Give me Isaiah fifty-five and six. Drop that. Mm. Drop what you got. Give me Isaiah fifty-five and six. The book of Isaiah, chapter fifty-five. Give me Ezekiel seven and two. Drop what you have. Give me Ezekiel seven and two. Come. It's the book of Isaiah, chapter fifty-five and verse number six. Right." <clears throat> Come. And give me, and give me, um, drop it you had. Give me so it. Verse uh, six: Seek ye the Lord, while he may be found. The Lord say, Seek, Seek ye the Lord, while he may be found. Right, meaning there's a time coming when you're not going to be able to get this knowledge, man. We're not always going to be out here, man. Right, that's right. The live streams aren't always going to be happening, man. Right, that's right. You're not going to always have access to the internet, man. You're not always going to have a uh, freedom to come out here and stand before and hear the servants of the Lord, man. That's right. You know how much knowledge these brothers got through your Hawabash and man? Huh. What they can break down to you in wisdom, knowledge, and understanding? You can't get that nowhere else, man. That's right. right. So here's your time now, man. That's right. All that slothfulness, all that lackadaisical behavior, all that, uh, 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 I'm doing my own thing, I'll get right when I feel like it. 
Maybe tomorrow. That maybe tomorrow, Spirit, you're going to get put to death, man. Uh, Wake him up. The Lord says, seek ye the Lord while he may be found. That's uh, all right. right. Repent while you can, man. That's right. right. Read. Call ye upon him while he is near. And you have to know the name of the Most High to call upon it, man. And the Most High's name is Yahweh. His son's name is Yahweh Shah. Call upon Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shah while you can, man. Uh, That's right. Once that door closed, it's over, man. Uh, You're going to be caught up in a damn famine, eating out of a dumpster. You're going to have women getting gang raped by other men on the earth. You're going to have homosexuals beating down door looking for men. These days are coming back to the earth, man. Uh, you know what happened during the time of Judges when everybody did what was right in their own eyes, man. Those days are coming back to the earth. It said there was no king in Israel, and everybody did what the hell they wanted to do, huh? Let me get that in uh, uh, Judges. Come. Right? 21, I believe that's the last verse. Come. 25. Yeah. Right? Give me that. Come. It's the book of Judges. Uh, it's the book of Judges. Come. Chapter 21 and verse 25. Get up. In those days, there was no king in Israel. Every man did that which was great in his own eyes. Every, every man read it from the top. Come. Judges. Let me get that file in your account. You see that? All of these men that don't repent, that want to ride bikes all damn day, you're going to get put to death, man. Right. Like it's a damn circus, man. It's a book of Judges, chapter 21 and verse 25. Right, and they all going to yoke their young ass off the bike, man, and throw them in the harbor, man. That's right, that's right. Throw them in the damn pit, man. The Lord going to have wild animals out here too, man. That's right. All hell going to be breaking loose. Right. going to be noisome beasts, pestilence. Wild damn packs and lions from the zoo, man. God, man damn, you running. Good. You get damn stabbed by a rhinoceros, man. God, it's gonna be crazy out here, man. Back. Damn gorilla hang down and pumps on you, man. Chimpanzee rip your face off. People coughing because they got the damn bubonic plague. Somebody get shot in the head while you ducking. It's gonna be chaos out here, man. God. The Lord said this will come to pass, man. Them damn peacoat days are coming to it, man. That's oh, right. Peacoat, man. Them days are over with, man. That's right. Read that. This is the book of Judges, chapter 21, verse 25. Read! In those days, there was no king in Israel. In those days, there was no king in Israel. And those days are coming, man. When you don't have rulers to be able to tell you what you can and can't do. And whatever you feel like is right, you're going to be able to do that, man. Mm. Right? Read! Every man did that which was right in his own eyes. Everybody want to do what they want to do, man. If, I feel, and, if people gonna feel like they want to just snatch up a woman that don't want to go through the routine of asking her on a date, and just they gonna do that, man. Huh? Wow. If men want to break into your house and, and then snatch your loaf of bread, they gonna do that, man. Huh? Right. They're not gonna That's ask right. you, hey, may I borrow a cup of sugar, man? Huh? Nah, they gonna, nah, you, nah. you gonna hear that beat at your door? It's gonna be nah. four in the morning. You gonna try to open it? He gonna bust through there. You gonna try to hold it back? But he might be stronger than you, man. Huh? Now, if he's stronger than you, hey, it's over, man. Uh, right? Now, either, either, either you get down or you give him that that damn sugar, man. He's gonna take over your house. Yeah, he's gonna take over your house. He might kick you <laughs> out, man. Right? And now you, now you a vagabond, man. People gonna be give me that in Second Ezra chapter fifteen to fifteen, man. People gonna be breaking into the damn houses for food, man. And I love going into the prophecy. Ain't that right? Don't you know race wars are coming to the earth? That's right. Don't you know America's about to be destroyed? That's right. Whole, whole Foods is coming to an end, man. That's right. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> <laughs> fuck you with your damn Whole Foods, <laughs> man. Book, right? Yeah. Book of Second Ezra, chapter 15 and verse 15. No, I want, I want Judges 19. Let's see what everybody's going to be doing in their own eyes. Okay. But the judges chapter 19, verse 25. Right. Yeah. But the men were not hearken to him. Start at 22. Kind. Verse 22. Now, as they were making their hearts merry. Now, people going to be making their hearts merry. This is going to happen. We brought this out that everybody did what was right in their own eyes. Because a lot of people don't believe us, man. So we have to go into the account of what happened. And the Lord says what? He requires that which is passed. Mm -hmm. That's written. That's Ecclesiastes 3 and 15. So you're going to have people eating and drinking and being merry. Go on. Behold, the men of the city... Certain sons of Baal, certain sons of Baal, which is the devil, demonic men, beset the house, beset the house, run about. They about to besiege the house like you go in the war. And beat at the door. And then what? And, and beat, beat at, at the, the door. door. The Lord say, and, and beat, beat at, at the door. door. You gonna be doing that, man? You gonna be in your house hiding in the damn attic? You gonna be beating at your damn door, man? Read. Expect to the master of the house and of the house, the old man saying. Bring forth the man that came to the house. Bring forth that man that came to your house. 
That we may know him. That what? That, that we, we may, may know him. These days are coming back, man. You're going to be in your house with a few men, a bunch of other men. They go, hey, hey, bring that man out that we may know him, man. Hey, these days are coming, man. They was doing this during the time of judges. <laughs> right? And it don't mean know him as in 21 questions, man. It's not the 50 cent Megan Good get to know you thing, man. This is a more, I want to literally, physically know you. If you could pick up what we putting down. Go on. It said, verse 23, And the man, the master of the house, went out unto them and said unto them, Nay, my brethren, nay, I pray you, do not so wickedly. And he said, don't do this, man. Don't take this man and just physically abuse him, man. That's wicked, man. Uh. Hey, but guess what? They already do that in D.C., man. In D.C., we always bring that up. They got the damn check-it game, man. That's a real thing, man. Brothers from that area, they know what I'm talking about. Yeah. Right? You know about that. Yeah. They got the check it game, man. Right? You said what? They uh, throw you in the van, you know, kind of kidnap you, you know, kind of all types of stuff. That's right. And Gabor, he's from that area, man. He got to go through hell over there, man. <laughs> Mystery vans out there that grab up men, yoke them up, do what they want to do, and throw them out, man. They already do that, man. So how, if they can do that and the law of America say don't do it, how much more when our hell breaking loose, man? Mm. They gonna be lusting. Men gonna be lusting. Women gonna be lusting. It's gonna be chaos out here, man. Huh. Right? Crime is gonna be at an all time high. Huh. So if you don't seek the Lord while, you, while he may be found, hey, this may happen to you, man. Go on. Seeing that, seeing that this man is coming to my house, do not dispel me. Right? Don't do that, Folly. Read. Verse 24 Behold. Here is my daughter. Here is my what? Here my, is daughter. my daughter. Here is my daughter. A maiden and his concubine. De them will I bring out now and humble ye them. Here, you can have these women. Just don't deal with this man. Don't sin. At least deal with these women. Go on. And do with them what seems good unto you. And that's what's going to be happening. People going to be, I mean, this is. They say we're getting graphic. This is in the Bible, man. Uh, right. The Bible get graphic, man. Uh, uh, it's not your granny's Bible, man. Uh, it's not your Christian pastor's Bible. Not quite. Why are you bringing up them precepts? That, that's too much. That's what that's in the Bible, man. Uh, you have to read it eventually. He said, bring out these women and do what I you want to do to them, man. Go on. But until this man do not so vow a thing. Read. But the men would not hearken to him. They don't want that. They don't want these women. They want man flesh, man. They don't want that sweet, t uh, tender, delicate love of a woman. They want man. Go on. So the man took his concubine and brought her forth unto them. So the man, he, he kind of snatched this woman up. She said, no, I don't want to. He said, get your, get, take you outside, man. And threw his concubine outside, man, to the wolves. Go and, on. And they knew her and abused her. And what? They knew her and, and abused, abused her. her. All the night until the morning. You see that, man? So these days are coming back to the earth, man. This is coming back to the earth. Huh. Read that again, man. And this for Eve that say, I don't need a man. I can do good all by myself, man. Hey, I'm not, I'm not going to sugarcoat a damn thing in this Bible, man. And they knew her. And, and these men, they knew her. And abused her. And they abused this woman. All the night, all the night, until the morning. Guess what, man? These days are coming back to the earth, man. That's right. That's right. All hell gonna be breaking loose. Men gonna be sieging houses. Women, this gonna be happening to women all night. Men gonna be getting jacked up. It's gonna be a famine, disease, wild damn elephants on the loose, man. People gonna be damn swimming, looking, trying to get to the next place. Esau gonna be going door to door. It's gonna be chaos out here, man. That's right. It's gonna be chaos, and it's gonna come to pass, man. It's written. Right. Read. And when the day began to spring, they let her go. See that? Sun came up. They said, ah, probably spit on them. And, and kept them moving, man. Right? Go on. Verse 26. Real disrespectful. Real, hey, they real disrespectful, man. Done. And they did this because there was no king in this room, man. Everybody did what they wanted to do. Go on. Dicking the women in the dawning of the day. And fell down at the door of the man's house. All right, she she just survived that, and she fell down. Baby, take me back, baby. Help me, help me. Baby. Yeah, yeah. Baby. She's done. Can't watch Bleeding. All types of chaos, right? man. Go on. And this is in in the Bible. Let's show you how wicked Israel was. Oh. Hey, all hell broke loose after this. You had a damn war going on, man. This wasn't a small thing. 
call a gangbang. Yeah. <laughs> Where her lord was till it was light. And, <laughs> and her lord rose up in the morning and opened the doors of the house and went out to go his way. And behold, the woman, the, the woman, his concubine, was falling down at the door of the house. So he about to leave and his woman just at the door of the house. Go on. And her hands were upon the threshold. She's like, hey, like, come on, track me in the house. him unto his place Reek. and when he was coming to the his house listen to this when he came to his house he picked up his concubine they got abused all night she already passed out right she's exhausted go on he took a knife he took a what a knife right. he's gonna be taking knives too man whatever weapon you find in the last days that's what you're going to use people gonna be getting back to damn sharpening sticks you better know how to make a fire because this man he's not going to make it man uh, yeah, that's, that's, right. That's, right. That's, right. that's right. That's right. He already right. know he's not going to make it, man. Santa can't save you, man. That's right. Uh -huh. And his elves can't save. He already confessed he's not going to make right. it. God. Who made him say that? Yahweh Bash now was shot me. That's right. right. Hey, the Lord said the preparations of the t uh, of the heart and the answer of the tongue is from the Lord, man. Right. Right. So he took a knife. He took a knife and laid and laid hold on his donkey bag and laid hold on her. And divided her together with her bones. You see, that cut her all up, man. People gonna be doing, get, getting real crazy in the last days, man. This man's savage, man. <laughs> he done cut his old woman up into 12 pieces and sit there, sit there in the mouth, man. You're gonna see things you never saw before. It's gonna get back to the book of Judges. Go back to Judges 21 and read that last verse. Like the brother said, horrific, man. It's one of the worst things that you ever, can ever read about in the scriptures, man. Right? It gets so bad, the Lord tell you in that account, hey, what you think about this, man? When you read that. Judges chapter 21 and verse 5. Bring it out. In those days, there 20, was... Is that 25? Got 21, 25. Yeah. Judges chapter 21 verse 25. In those days... And again, we're bringing this out because the Lord says, seek him while you may be found. These days are coming back to the earth. In those days... There was no king in Israel. You're not going to have a president. You're not going to have a, poli a police force. They're going to be looking to make it on their own. Huh? <laughs> Damn, Baltimore Police Department, LAPD, NYPD, then whatever. Hey, they're going to throw that badge and gun and say, look, I got to protect my own family. Uh, huh? They're going to they're gonna keep the gun. They're going to keep the badge. If you buy the police badge, a lot of people are going to be pretending they're the damn police. Man. Uh, that's right. People are going to be pretending they damn part of the uh, damn government officials, man. You gonna find badges, max, not max identities. It's gonna be chaos out here. KKK out there, run, run the trucks, man. Like the brother said, you gonna hey, for you. right now the KKK they gotta lay low. They gotta lay low due to societal standards. Now when all hell break loose, right. hey, they're not gonna need a mask. That, now they may use it for fear tactics, but more than likely they're gonna take that thing off. They're more dangerous with the mask off than with the mask on. Wow. If they come with you with the mask off, you ain't gonna really know. Right. The men of the Lord, we know you're an Edomite. Right. But the average people, they can't be a KKK. You don't have to take KKK. Right? You can't be the devil. All these damn Edomites are devils. That's right. That's right. That's right. Every, every man did that which was right in his own eyes. So every man did what he wanted to do, man. Give me 2nd Ezra chapter 15 and start at 14. 2nd Ezra. Oh, go ahead. I'll bring it up. And because of that, almost 100,000 Israelites died in war. Yeah, that was a mass. Like we brought up, that wasn't a small thing, man. You had a, a major civil war with the children of Benjamin, man. And the rest of Israel. It got so bad that our father said, if you give your son, I mean your daughter to a man of Benjamin, you go to hell off, man. That's how bad it said. You're not dealing with these niggas. Huh? That's what our father said about the children of Benjamin. See that? Benjamin oh, is a Benjamin, huh? God, right? Let's bring that up. But he, he made it. Paul was a Benjamite too. Kind of made it back. Hey, brother, come hear the word, brother. Come get the word, brother. There you go, brother. That's right, brother. That's right. That's all right, brother. That's all right. That's all right. What's your nationality, brother? Um, African American. You said African American and what? African American. African American. Are right, you believe in the Bible? Uh, you a God fearing man? I'm spiritual, I'm saying somewhat. Alright, alright, you're spiritual. Now, African American, 
It's a man-made thing. Who, who gave us that title of African American? I would say man. What man? White man, I guess. Right, the so-called white man. You would agree, right? I would. All right. Now, according to God, did God call you an African American? No. It would be impossible if we just concluded that man came up with that. Okay. Right? Give me Deuteronomy 32 and 8. Let's see what the Lord called you. Because I would want to know that. How old are you, brother? 19. 19, brother. 19 years old. It would be a nice thing to find out who you are, man. It would be a, 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 a gift, man, of right. the Lord. Right? Bring that up. Book of Deuteronomy, chapter 32, and verse 8. When the Most High divided the nations. When the Lord say? When, when the, the Most, Most High divided, divided the, the nations. nations. So God has different nations of people. Mm -hmm. 18 nations. When God divided the nations. Their inheritance. Their inheritance. When he separated the when he, sons. When he of, did what? When he separated, separated the, sons. the sons of Adam. He separated the sons of Adam. He set the bounds of the people according to the number of the children of Israel. Read. For the Lord's portion is his people. Jacob is the lot of his inheritance. So the point is, the Lord has many nations of people, but now it said Jacob is his people. So he has a chosen people too. You have many different types of flowers and trees mm -hmm. and animals in the sky and in the water and in the forest, but they're not all the same, brother. Right? They may share a common living or ecosystem, whatever word you want to use, but they're different. You have many people on the earth with all different types of shapes, colors, and sizes, but God has a chosen people. Who are his chosen people? Uh, there you go, the Israelites. That's right. Us, brother. We, we're the chosen people. Us. Now, how do we know that we're the Israelites? How do we know that? Is this a bunch of baloney that we're giving you? Right? A bunch of uh, 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 folly? How do we know that we're the Israelites? I'm going to show you in two minutes or less. Give well, me that. I, I got to go, but I appreciate it. Well, brother, you don't want to find out who you are. It takes two minutes to find out who you are. I mean, two minutes, pretty, brother. Two, don't really you want him to know who he is? I went to a Catholic school. Like, uh, don't, you, know. don't you Don't you want him to know who he is? Y'all together, right? This is our first date. Y'all first date. Well, what better date than to find out who y'all are? Uh, and and let's, let's read that real quick. I'm going to tell you something about y'all date. Right. About y'all date after this, all right? 28. I'm gonna give y'all some. I'm gonna give you some master advice, brother, through the spirit about this date. And both of y'all should want to stick around and hear that. Bring that up. Deuteronomy 28, 68. Book of Deuteronomy. Are y'all willing to stick around and hear the master advice about your date? Sure, I'd love to. Uh, that's right. Yeah, that's right. Okay, we're gonna hold y'all to that. So go to 28 and 15. Con, the book of Deuteronomy, chapter 28 and verse 15. Right? But it shall come to pass. It says, but it shall come to pass, it will happen. If thou wilt not hearken into the voice of the Lord thy God. The Israelites, the people in the sun. Right? The people that Moses took out of the land of Egypt. Right? And parted the Red Sea for. And gave them laws and commandments. If they don't listen, go off. To observe, to do all his commandments. If they don't follow God's commandments. And his statutes. Which I command thee this day. What would happen to these people, our people, when I follow the commandments? That all these curses. curses that what? That all, all these curses, curses shall come upon thee and oh, overtake thee. What's a curse? If we put curses on people, is that a good thing or an evil thing? Evil. evil. God just said that one nation of people will be cursed for breaking the commandments. Uh. Whoever's cursed, they're the Israelites. Because that's who he's talking to. You understand? Let's find out one of the curses. Go to 68. Straight Verse 68. It reads, And the Lord shall send thee and the Lord shall bring thee into Egypt again. Here's the curse, that this people will go back into Egypt again. Now, what were the Israelites doing in Egypt before Moses delivered them? Um, Y'all know, you went to Catholic school. Did they teach you that one? Wait, 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 can you repeat that? So, when Moses came into power through the Most High, and he said, let my people go, where did he let his people go from? What were they doing? Slavery. 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 There you go. Slavery. Now, they were slaves in Egypt, right? Now, during the time of Deuteronomy, they're already out of slavery. They're receiving the law again. But the curse is, if they don't keep the commandments, they're going to go back into Egypt again. Right? Meaning back into what? Slavery. Exactly. Back into slavery. So read it from the top one more time. Con, the book of Deuteronomy, chapter 28 and verse 68. No, but we're reading about it. the Israelites. Go on. It reads, and the Lord shall bring thee into Egypt again. God said that the Israelites will go back into Egypt again. They will go into slavery again. With ships. With what? With, with ships. ships. On a plane. With, with ships. ships. On a bus. With, with ships. ships. On a train. With, with ships. ships. Who 
was sent to slavery on ships? You, you say black. Africans, Africans, Africans. No, who was God talking to? Oh, Israelites. Exactly, the Israelites. That's right. So we were taught that we was blacks and Africans and all of these different terms. God never called us that. God said those are the Israelites. Come. That's our real nationality by blood. Not according to what the man said. This is what the Moses said about us. Come. Right, read on. More of that. Come. By the way, whereof I expect unto thee, right? Thou shalt see it no more again. Thou shalt what? Thou, thou shalt, shalt see, see it no more again. again. And there ye shall be sold unto your enemies. And there what? And, and there ye shall, shall be sold unto your enemies. So once we get off that slave ship, the Lord said that we'll be sold to our enemies. Sure. Who are we sold to? Um, whites. Whites. That's right. Said what? Colonizers, whites, you would agree, right? Sure. Now, read it, but read that part again. Yes, sir. Thou, I'll you, thou shalt see it no more again, and there you shall be sold unto your, your enemies. enemies. So, our enemies, this is so called white, we established it, right? Uh, I guess, yeah. Alright, that's what the Lord said. Did I guess, or is that right? Go on. And there you shall be sold unto your enemies. For bond men and, and bond, bond women. women. For slave men and slave women. And, and no man shall buy you. So who is that talking about, brother? What's your name, brother? Sebastian. Sebastian. Sebastian, what is that talking about? Who, who, who fits that prophecy out of everybody on the earth? All of the different races and ethnicities and people on the earth. Who was sent to slavery on ships, sold to their enemies, and never went back to their homeland? I guess the blacks. You say the black Israel. 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 The Israelites. Israel. Right. Right. So right. what would that make you, brother? Israelite. Exactly. Right. 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 That would make you an Israelite, huh? That's how we can prove it. Remember, we said, well, can we prove that we the Israelites? We open up the Bible and the Lord tells you how you know based off of these curses documented in Deuteronomy 28. And that's just one of them. Right? And I'm gonna give you one more real quick. I know y'all on y'all date even one more. Deuteronomy 28 and 16. Con, Deuteronomy chapter 28, verse 16. Right? Cursed shall thou be in the city. The Lord say, Cursed shall thou be in the city. Another curse, not only would this nation be sold into slavery on ships, but they will also be cursed in the cities that they live in. Have y'all ever been to the ghettos and the projects? Um once, couple times. Once, once couple yeah. times. Where at? What city? Baltimore, what about you? You ever been in the ghettos, projects? New York. You've been in projects? I've, I've been through them, yeah. I've never lived in them. But you kind of drove past them? Sure. Okay. <laughs> Go on. Cursed shall thou be in the city, right? And cursed shall thou be in the field. And we all know who had to work in the fields. I mean, come on now. Let's let's just bring it up. Let's take the time machine back to the 1800s. Who was working in the fields? No. Uh, no. You know the answer. The Israelites. The Israelites. Right. Okay, yeah, yeah. The Israelites. That's our real. Yeah, we got to get rid of this black, this white. All of these are man-made terms. That's right. I mean, are you really black, brother? Look at you. Look at my. Look you're at right, our skin. Right. No, no. Are, are you really white? No. I mean, I mean, so, so we got to get rid of these terms, and we have to go off of what God called us. The Lord called us the Israelites. All right. And now, why did these curses happen to us? Uh, why, 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 why would God, if, if supposedly y'all think God loves everybody, mm -hmm. you think that the Lord really loves everybody on the earth? I don't think so, yeah. All right, and you think everybody's equal? Yeah. All right, do you agree everybody's equal? I believe everyone deserves to be treated equally. All right, but do you believe everybody's equal? You'd have to expand on that. Okay, okay, I'm going to show you. Give me Deuteronomy, because you said, what'd you say again? Give me Deuteronomy 10 and 15, and Deuteronomy 7 and 6. What'd you say again, Sebastian? Uh, I said, people are equal. Uh, does God love everyone? Yeah, does God love everybody? I'm going to show you something about, about, about people on the earth. 10 and 15. 10 and 15 and 7 and 6. Okay. Deuteronomy chapter 10, verse 15, it reads, Only the Lord had a delight in the Father to love them. Only the Lord had a delight in thy fathers to love them. And he chose their seed. He chose and, everybody. He chose, chose their, their seed. seed. All the earth. He chose, chose their, their seed. seed. The Lord said, I got all these people. I'm going to choose these people. The Israelites. I'm going to choose their seed. Read. Come. After them. After them. 
Even you above all people. No, same as everybody. Even you above all people. Equal to everybody. Even you above all people. Choose your seed and you're above all people. As it is this day. Even in 2020. Right? Even in 2020, in the month of December, the Lord said that our people are above all people. So, brother, you're great, brother. Right? There's no significance in being black. Right? There's nothing good that comes with that. Right? What's great about being an Israelite? Understand that you're the son of the Most High God. Man. Right. And that this entire earth was made for you. Man. That's right. And the right. kingdom of heaven is only for you. Man. That's right. And the Most High, he sent his son to die for you to give you a chance to come back to the Most High as an Israelite. And we're going to keep the commandments. That's right. right. That's what it's all about, brother. It's not about having fun and celebrating Christmas and enjoying life in America. This place about to be shut down. That's right. right. The Most High is about to shut America down economically, financially, ultimately, physically, this place is going to be destroyed. Man. That's right. America is a land that has been created to be destroyed by God. That's right. Is America a just place? Is this a place of fairness and equity? Do y'all get treated the exact same if y'all were to get pulled over by the police? Let's be honest. Let's not let's not beat around the bush. Let's be real. Do y'all get treated the same? No. No. Why don't y'all get treated the same? Why not? Let's just be real. Let's not let's get the elephant off the room. Stereotypes. No, it's not stereotypes. Racism. So-called racism. Would you agree? Yes. Now racism, right? Some of the, the fruits of racism is slavery, rape, robbery, and murder. Now, give me Deuteronomy 7 and 3. Here's, here's, here, here's the master advice. I wasn't okay, going to leave you. This is the master advice about y'all date. The book of Deuteronomy, chapter 7 and verse 3. I want y'all, now this is Sebastian, what's your name? Natty. Natty, Nat, Natty and Sebastian. And y'all first date. All right? This, 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 y all, y all, no. now, now listen to what the Lord said. Deuteronomy, chapter 7 and verse 3. Read. Neither shall they make marriages with them. What the Lord say? Neither, neither shall, shall they make marriages, marriages with them. them. The Lord is talking to the Israelites, the people in his son. He said, neither shall these people make marriages with them. Who's the them? Everyone outside of Israel. There you go. Right. Natalie, Natalie. You, you, Natty. You, Natty, Natty, <laughs> all right. You, you, you're, doing, you're going well. Right? You're taking good steps. Thank Sebastian, you on there? You're yeah, picking I'm getting, up. I'm getting, I'm coming around. Are you coming around? So God said that the people in this sign cannot make marriages with the other people. Do y'all plan on getting married? Would you marry a black man or would you marry a white woman? Let's just be real. We be real would, all night. I would. I would. You would? Yes. And you would marry a white woman? Yes. Now, what did God say? Did God say you can do that? Um. Or, or did America say you can do that? What if I am an Israelite? Well, I mean, did your people go to slavery on ships and were sold to their enemies? I'm Jewish. All right, well, Ooh. hold on now. Really? Now, you, like, is your, is can, your, can we go? Like, well, you, well, you said your father's Jewish. My mother is Jewish, which makes you a Jew. And no, no, yes, it doesn't. Yes, no, it doesn't. It, okay, Google No, it doesn't. It, no, we don't have to Google it. We're going to yeah. go in the Bible. If right. you're a don't you believe? Jewish, give me numbers 1 to 18. Jew. Do they teach you the Torah? Yes. Have you learned the Torah? I have did read they, the Torah. Did they go to the book of Numbers? Yes. What does Numbers 1 and 18 tell you? I couldn't tell you after Because one. I'm going to show you. I know y'all got to go, but listen. Numbers right. 1 and 18. Numbers, numbers, numbers 1 and verse 18. And they assembled all the congregations together. All the congregation of the Israelites. On the first day of the second month of the second okay. month. And they declared their pedigrees. They what? They, they declared, declared their, their pedigrees. Y'all seem like y'all are intelligent in the world. What does the word pedigree mean? What is a pedigree? If you breed dogs and you want to find pedigree, what is that? It's the standard. It's the level that you're on. It's your genealogy. It's your records. Your genetics. So the nation of people, their pedigree is what? After the families. By the house of their okay, fathers. fathers. After your mothers. By the, the house, house of their fathers. fathers. God says you are what your father is. That's, that's right. in the Torah. That's in the Bible. That's right. So if your father is an Israelite, that would make you an Israelite. If your mother is a so-called white woman, that, that has no significance. It's all right. about what your father is. Now, if your that's father right. is a so-called white man, is he? Yeah. Then you would be an Edomite. That's, that's right. Right? That's right? You wouldn't be an Israelite. We read that the true Israelites will be cursed in the city. You drove past the ghettos. We live in the ghettos. That's right. That's right. That's right. You drive past the projects. We work and stand in the projects. That's right. We was in the bottom of the slave ship, Sebastian, you. Your people was driving the slave ships 
operating it, being the sailors, and coming up with all of the lumber and wood. Check out the history of the Jewish people. Y'all were the ones that financed the slave trade, huh? Right. So right. you said you would marry a black man, you would marry a black woman. Y'all can't do that according to God. That's if right. you do that, God is going to kill you and destroy you. That's in the Bible. That's, great. That's not our words. Nice. So, Natalie, you going into slavery. That's That's right. Right. You're going, huh? That's no, you're going to slavery. I don't give a damn what your name is. That's That's right. Right. Your name is Slave. That's right. So, Natalie going to slavery. Sebastian, get out. That's right. Get out. Get out. Get out. Right, big old big bear, polar bear, grizzly bear, man. Huh? We joined the way to back linebacker, man. Huh? Yeah, defensive tackle, man. Damn, DT, man. Huh? Yeah, Brian Erlacher, man. Three point stats, man. And wide nine, man. You know? So the Lord not dealing with this damn interracial. Right? I want to marry the so called white woman, man. I hope we ruin their date, man. Huh? I hope they never recover. Huh? Right? I hope they kind of, they, they have an awkward silence, man. Yeah, man, don't, don't you ever, don't, it's okay, don't, it's okay, man. it's okay, baby. Don't the white man, you know, they, God, God loves everybody. The, the Lord don't love everybody. Oh, that's right. right. And, and, and people, hey, when a race war kick, kick off, we back in second measure 15. Go back to the race war. Because Natalie, she going to join her people, man. Right? Right, right, right. And guess what, Sebastian, if he don't get over his damn identity crisis, a lot, a lot of Jake's, who, who, who deal with uh not not all of them? A lot of Jakes that's fair skinned and so called biracial don't know what's going on. They have a damn identity crisis, man. Huh? They got a problem trying to figure out if they Edomites or if they Israelites, man. Huh? That's why a lot of them say I'm mixed, I'm biracial, I'm foreign. I don't know who I am. Uh, uh, as a right, you dealt with one earlier, man. Huh? Right, a lot of them don't know what's going on. Not all of them, right? But a lot of them don't know what's going on, man. Huh? So read that, King. Book of Second Ezra. If you don't get over there, you're going to get put to death. Chapter 15. Let's start at 14. 15 to 14 again. Come on. Book of Second Ezra, chapter 15, and verse 14. Come the words, brothers. Woe to the world and them that dwell therein. Read. For the sword and their destruction undraweth nigh. So the sword and destruction draws nigh. What's going on, young brothers? What's your nationality? Black. What about you, brother? Both of y'all are black. Are y'all the color of y'all uh, hoodies? Is your skin the same color as your hoodie? No. So are you black? No, brother. You, you're just a dark brown. All right? Y'all not black. Y'all believe in the Bible? I believe in the Bible. All right. What about you, brother? Same. Same. Why don't you read the Bible, brother? What's the beef? What's going on? I can't go find the you don't find it interesting? Do you know what the people in the Bible look like? I'm, I'm going to tell you something real quick, brother. They, this might spark your interest. Give me Revelation 1 to 13. Let me get that sign, Mike, the Bible just shut. I'm going to ask you a question. It's the book of Revelation. Who is this? Who's that? Hold on, let's come up. Come up. We ain't going. We're going we're gonna to do the work. Who's this man right here? That's Jesus. You don't know who that is, brother. You know that's Jesus. That's not Jesus. All right. What'd you say? All right. Now, is this is this what he looked like according to the Bible? I'm gonna show you something, brother. Before you leave, so you gonna learn something today. We're gonna read the actual description of what Jesus looked like. Hold on, I got you, King. And you tell me if it fit this image right here. All right. If it fits that image, we packing up and we leaving. We all gonna give you one grand. Right. All of us, man. We all gonna throw, dish out one grand. And some of these brothers got more money than others, man. They might give you two. Yeah, yeah. Right? So listen carefully, brother. And as we, oh, see that? Brother, I threw his wallet out there. Man. I turned around, there's a wallet on the floor. Damn. Right? Oh, see yeah. that right there? <laughs> now, y'all listen, brother. This what? Hey, who threw that? <laughs> oh, yeah. Well, damn. <laughs> That's heavy. That's saying a lot, man. <laughs> right? I don't call them Gabar money bags for no reason. <laughs> Now, brother, as we read this description, tell me if it fit that. Revelation 1 and 13. Right, it's it the out. book of Revelation, chapter 1 and verse 13. Read it out. And in the midst of the seven candlesticks, one like unto the Son of Man. The Son of Man is who they call Jesus Christ. Go off, clothed with a garment down to the foot. Oh, yeah, skinny jeans and bands. Clothed oh, with a man. garment down, down to, to the, the foot. foot. Like my garment, brother, but it was a little bit longer down to the foot. That's what the Lord had on. Go off. <clears throat> and... Girt about the paps 
with their golden girdle. And he had a golden girdle on. Y'all remember WWF, WWE? You know the championship belt? That's what the Lord had on. Girded about his caps with a golden girdle. Read. His head and his hairs were white like wool. Read that part again. His head and, and his, his hairs, hairs were white, white like wool. Read it one more time. His, his head and his, his hairs were white, white like wool. Is that woolly hair, brother? What race of people have woolly hair? Who has hair that's what they call it, nappy, kinky, like a sheep? Us. Exactly. The Lord said that the Bible, I mean, the Bible says that the Lord will have woolly hair. That's long, stringy hair. You see the hair? Like the horse mane. That's not, that's not real uh, uh, woolly hair. And it said as white as snow. Right? You see the elder right here? That's woolly. And as white as snow. That's what we're reading about. Go on. So that's strike one in that image and it's strike two. Go on. As white as snow. Read. And his eyes were as a flame of fire. That man don't have red eyes. Right. He got passive eyes, man. Blue baby brown eyes. Go on. And his feet. And his feet. His skin color. Like unto fine grass. Like unto what? Like fine grass. grass. Like unto what? Fine grass. Like unto what? Fine grass. His feet, his skin color is fine brass. What color is brass? Brass. B R A S S. Brown. Brown. There you go, brother. So his skin color like fine brass, but let's see how brown he is, because y'all are two different shades of brown, right? And we got brother light brown, we got dark brown up here. What brown was our Lord? And his feet like it's a fine brass. As if they burned in a furnace. As if they burned in a furnace. The Lord Jesus Christ was so dark, it looked like he got burnt in a furnace. That's right. Read. And his voice as the sound of many waters. And he spoke with authority. Right? So the Lord would be what? What would he look like? What race of people? He would look like us. That's right. That's right. That's right. right. So who, who is this man? You don't know, right? Is that Jesus? No. Where did that come from? From the so-called white man, the devil, man. That's right. right. Who created that image to deceive you and lie to you and, and make it seem and put you right where you at right now, brother. That's why you came up and said you don't find it interesting. You don't find it interesting because you don't see yourself in this book. That's right. That's why would right. I open up a photo album and it's all white people? Why would I get interest in that, man? I want to see my people, man. That's I want to see right. people at the cookout, man. I want to see the fish fry. Right? I want to see what's going on at the basketball court when I open up the photo album. If I open up a photo album and there's other, another nation in there, I'm going to put it down because it don't belong to me. That's right. Am I right? This is what our people do when they open up the Bible. They open it up and they feel like it don't belong to them because they can't see themselves in this book due to images like that created by the so-called white man to destroy you mentally. Matthew 24 and 24. 2 Corinthians chapter 11 and 12. Wisdom of Solomon chapter 15 and 4. Right? Listen to this, brother. The book of Matthew chapter 24 and verse number 4. 24. 24. It's like it reads, For there shall rise false Christ. What the Lord say? For there, there shall, shall rise false Christ. The Lord said, You will have fake images of me. That's what the Lord said. That's written in red, right? Down. The Lord, who you call Jesus Christ, whose real name is Yahweh Shah, he said, There shall what? For there shall rise false Christ. You're going to have a false Christ set up. Read. And false prophets. And false prophets like this man said, I love everybody. They make movies about that man. Right. Go on. And so, so, great signs and wonders. That's a big sign. They got big signs of it. It's wonderful to the people. And so much if it were hot, so like it. And so much that if it were possible, if it were possible, they shall deceive the very elect. Are you deceived by that image, brother? Do you, are you deceived by that? So y'all could be part of the elect, man. Mm. Y'all could be part of the elect. Only, only the non-elect, the people that's not chosen, they get deceived by that. The chosen, we don't get deceived by that thing right there, man. Right. The masses of people on the earth, they worship that image, man. Right. Right. They, they say that that's Jesus, man. That would be a lie. Huh. All right, read that. Book of Second Corinthians, chapter eleven, and verse twelve. Three, verse three. All right, listen to this. You got that? Let's bring it up. <clears throat> it's the book of Wisdom of Solomon, chapter fourteen, and verse fifteen. Uh, fifteen and four. Uh, it's lucky. Uh, fifteen and four. For neither 
did the mischievous invention of men deceive us. Neither did the mischievous invention of man deceive us. We used to think that that was Jesus, man. Hey, we was all raised up in church, man. They said, you better look, look, that's Jesus, man. They make the movies about it. Y'all know what I'm talking about, mm. right? Read, nor an image spotted with diverse colors, the painter's fruitless labor. And the painter actually made that. There is an actual, have y'all heard of the man Michelangelo before? Or Leonardo da Vinci? Yeah. He's the one that was sanctioned by Pope Alexander VI to paint an image of his boyfriend, Caesar Borges. Hold on, I heard of it on the Titanic, like the, the Ninja Turtles. Yeah, 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 that's, that's one of them. They have, uh, they're named after uh, Renaissance so-called painters, right? Michelangelo, Donatello, Raphael, right? But this guy, he was painted by Michelangelo. You see that? That's a real man. But they said, we're gonna take this so-called white man, we want him to be the new face of Jesus. Cause we don't want the true people of God to see themselves in the book anymore, right? We want them to think that they black and niggers and monkeys and African American. We cannot let these people know that they're the chosen people of God. Mm. If they find out they're the chosen people of God, our kingdom is over. The right. jig is up, the cat is out the bag, right? But the Lord spoke the beans, the Lord got this thing planned out, oh, God, right? So that painters proof this labor, read, the sight whereof entices fools to lust after it. So this this entices a fool to lust after it. People come up here and say, why y'all got Jesus on the floor? Why you got horns of my Jesus? Right? Take horns off of my Jesus. Hey, a fool would lust after that. I want to marry a man like that, man. That's why so-called black women marry men that look like that. They think they got Jesus, man. Finally got me a Jesus, man. He going to take care of me. And, and, and he gonna love me, huh? Right? Means meanwhile, you just had this so-called white woman who killed her uh, her husband, huh? She stabbed up the um, so-called black man. You uh, seen that? Uh, yeah, so yeah, that was all over the news, man. So, brother, you would be an Israelite according to the Bible. That's right. The, our Lord Jesus Christ would be an Israelite. That's right. Give me Deuteronomy right. 28. Huh. Book, of Deuter Book of Deuteronomy, chapter 28. And verse 15. Right? But it shall come to so pass. So here today, brother, you're gonna find out that you are not a black man. Alright? You listening, brother? You too. Y'all are kings, man. Y'all are not niggas and African Americans. Right. Today y'all gonna learn this, man, and don't let it go. No, Read right. it from the top. Book of Deuteronomy, chapter 28, and verse 15. Read. Read. But it shall come to pass. But it shall come to pass. If thou wilt not hearken unto the voice of the Lord thy God. If we don't listen as a people to the Most High God, give me Amos 3 and 1 of the class. To observe to do all his commandments. To observe to do all his commandments. And his statutes, which I command thee this day. That what? That all, all these curses, curses. All these blessings. All, all these curses. All these good things. All, all these curses. curses. See that? All these curses. Shall come upon thee and overtake, and overtake thee. God said one nation of people is going to be cursed if they break the commandments, man. Come. What people are we talking about? Us. I mean, how do you know it's us, though? We will have to see the curses. All right, go to 28 and 54. Let's right. see one of the curses. Tell me who this happened to. Deuteronomy 28 and 54. 28 and verse 54. So that the man that is tender among you and very delicate. Brotherly love that we used to have. His eyes shall be evil toward his brother. What people eyes evil towards each other? Who's known for killing each other? Us. Us. That's your eye being evil towards your brother. That's in the Bible. Normally, you will walk past, you'll see a group of so-called black, Hispanic, or Native American men. Next thing you know, a damn shootout could happen. All hell could break loose. You walk past and they look at you like this. Like he want to fight you. I know y'all been through stuff like that, right? The so-called white men don't go through that thing, man. Right. They go through and they shake each other's hand. Right. They go yeah. see it and their dogs are walking. They, what kind of dog is that? Well, he's a so-and-so. And can I pet him? Can I spend a night with your dog? And they, and they do stuff like that, man. Yeah. The Chinese man, they get each other, ding dong, boing, dong, dong, and they bow down to each other, man. <laughs> the African man, they click clack. They, they do all of that stuff and throw sticks down the street. <laughs> right. <laughs> all, all of that, man. The nations, the point is, the nations love each other when they meet each other, man. They embrace each other. They understand they need each other, man. We're the only nation of people that look at our fellow soldiers and commit friendly fire, man. Mm, you look at them, then kill your own brother, man. Right, right. Your fellow soldier in the same war that you're going on, man. Right. Right? So the Lord said, I will be evil towards our brother. What else? And toward the wife of his bosom. And towards your wife. Read. 
and towards the remnant of his children. And this man will have his children. Which he shall leave. Which what? Which, which he, he shall, shall leave. Who is known for having children and then leaving them? Uh, us. Who is us, brother? No, did God call us the black people? Give me Deuteronomy 1 and 1. What did God call us, man? We got to take this word black. If next time I hear black, I'm going to lose my damn mind, man. Black is a color. There is no country called black. No land called black. There is no language in the land of black. No music in the land of black, man. Right. I'm going to pluck my beard out if I hear somebody say that again. Come. Read that. Deuteronomy chapter 1 verse 1. Let's find out who y'all men are. These be the words which Moses spake unto all Israel. To all the black people. And to all Israel. All African Americans. To all Israel. Unto all Israel. Y'all are Israel. Israelites. Right. We fulfill the curses in Deuteronomy chapter 28. That's and right. nobody else does. That's, That's right. right. No other nation of people can say that my uh, my uh, men and my soldiers kill each other and then they leave their children after they have them. Right? That's right. That'll happen in the so-called white household. Right. It'll happen in the Arab household. They own delis for generations. They own corner stores for generations. They own mom and pop shops for gen generations. Right. They them damn corporations, man. Forever. Right. right. Let's get another curse. Here we go. Go to verse 16. Deuteronomy 20, y'all finding out that y'all are the Israelites. That's right. Verse 16. Curse shall thou be in the city, and curse shall thou be in the field. Which people live the worst in the cities in America? Oh, us. Who's us? No. Who are we? No. Israel. There you go, That's brother. Right. That's right. The, this, brother, the Israelites. Remember, those are terms that we were given in the society. You have to grow up with the most high called you, huh? Come. I would never call myself what my enemy called me, man. Huh? Come. My That's enemy that right. conquered me, raped my mother, raped my sister, raped my father, right. stole my land, and, and I'm going to go off of what he called me? Uh, I would be a fool, man. Huh? Let the Most High be true in every man alive. That's man. right. Hey, what did the Most High call me, man? Let me go seek that thing out, man. Let me go find out who I really am. Not according to man, but what did God call me, man? That's right. Is that not important in the last days? Right? The Lord said that we are the Israelites. That's right. Right? So the Lord said what? Curse shall thou be in the city. Read it again. Curse, verse 16. Curse shall thou be in the city. Curse shall thou be in the city. And curse shall thou be in the field. Who had to work in the fields? Who was picking cotton? Whose hands was bleeding? Whose back was beat in? No. Oh wait, us. Oh, wait, us. I, 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 well, you're right, his back was beat in. The right. Lord's back was beat in. Right. Right? The Lord was in captivity too during the time of the Romans. Right. Right? Don't 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 get it twisted. The Lord went through what we went through. Come. I know your works and tribulation. Come. Right? A man acquainted with sorrows and grief. That's written from Nazareth. So the point is, we fulfill that curse. Let's give one more. Go to 68. Bring it out. Verse 68. Huh? Right. 68? Yeah. Verse 68. Bring it out. And the Lord shall bring thee into Egypt again. Right? The Lord said he'll bring us into Egypt again. Egypt is talking about slavery. Right? What were we doing in Egypt? Do y'all remember? All right, let's find out. This is the book of Exodus, chapter 20 and verse 2. Bring it out. I, I want Judah 5 and 11. Come. I want Judah chapter 5 and 11. Right? I want the book of Judah 5 and 11. Have y'all seen the movie Prince of Egypt? Ten Commandments? Y'all familiar with that? Or you going you gonna to get a refresher? The book of Judah, chapter 5 and verse 11. Right? It reads, Therefore the king of Egypt rose up against them and dealt with Subtilly, so I can, and dealt subtly with them. Right, so the king of Egypt rose up against us, go on. And brought them low. And brought, look, this happened in Egypt 4,000 years ago. The king of Egypt brought us low. With laboring in brick and made them slaves. And what? And, and made, made them, them slaves. slaves. What were we doing in Egypt? And made, made them, them slaves. slaves. What were we doing in Egypt? We were slaves. We built pyramids in Egypt. We built cities, Python and Ramses, and treasured things. In Egypt, now the curse is after we left Egypt. God said, if you don't keep my commandments, I'm going to send you back into Egypt again. Back into slavery again. Read it from the top. 
and the Lord shall bring thee into Egypt again. Into slavery again. With, with ships. ships. With what? With, with ships. ships. Who was sent to slavery on cargo slave ships? Who? Who's us? There you go. Right. Right. Israelites. Israelites. Go on. By the way, we are off. I spake unto thee. Right. Thou shalt see it no more again. And we're the only people on the earth that have never been back to our homeland again. That's right. Go on. And there ye shall be sold unto your enemies. And we were sold to our enemies. Are not your last names the last names of white men? Am I lying? Or are y'all still have your know, records from Jerusalem? Or is your last name something like Davis, Johnson, Smith, Anderson, Williams? Right? Something like that, right? Y'all fit that. Go on. For bond men and bond women, right? And no man shall buy you. So we're reading about y'all people in the Bible. Our right. people, right? That's right. Brother, you said that you, you have no interest in it, but you fit this more than right. anybody, right? right? That's right. Anybody right. in the earth, right? If I found out that this book was about me, then surely I would die of fizzy waters, man. That's right. That's right. That's right. And buy bread and wine and milk without money and without price, man. That's right. I would dive into these things. Because it doesn't fit the so-called white man. He wasn't sick of slavery on ships. The Arab man wasn't sick of slavery on ships. The Chinese man, tell them to come up here and prove to me in history. I want the year, I want the month, and I want the day when your people were sent to slavery on ships, sold, not allowed to go back to their homeland, and still in that land to this day. All right. If they can come up here and prove that, then we'll pack up and leave, huh? But they can't prove that thing, huh? Only the people of God can prove that they're the Israelites, huh? That's right. Right? Let's get another one. Hey, y'all brothers, come up here to work. Come learn something. Come on, brother. Brother. Come on, brother. Y'all come learn something, man. Y'all right, come, come learn something that's profitable, man. Y'all come find out and acquire knowledge, man. Our young men are famished out here, man. Our young men, all they want to do is smoke, get high, have sex, get drunk, pop a perk, right? Wear, get the latest joints, play the PS5, play 2K, buy some Henny. That's all the niggas want to do, man. But nobody want to get the, and, they, and while they doing that, they complaining about the injustice that we experience here in America, right? Right. But I mean, where, I mean, what you doing about it, man? What playing the PS5 going to do about it, man? Right. Right? What smoking the blunt, damn, and, and, and lacing it with damn PCP going to do about it, man? I mean, what has it done, man? Right. Ain't doing a damn thing, man. No. Ain't going to do a damn thing. So, brothers, y'all got to repent as the Israelites, man. Y'all are God's chosen people, man. You have to return back to the Most High and serve the Lord because you're living in the last days. Right. Right. I don't know if anybody told you, brother, but you're living in the end of the world, huh? Right. You're living in a time of no other, right? You're living in a time where the Most High is about to shut this whole thing down, huh? That's right. Everything you see that has light and as vibrant and animated around you is going to be dark, diminished, and it's going to be weeping and gnashing the teeth out here. Right. Right. All these scooters, that's shut down. Right. All the people having fun, that's going to be shut down. Right? Give me the book of all the Ecclesiastes, chapter 12 or 4. Right? So, brothers, y'all got to repent. Y'all know how to repent? How you repent? Give me, give me, uh, uh, um, Psalms 38 and 18. That's all right, brothers. We was on that side one time, huh? Brothers didn't know what was going on. They don't teach you nothing. How, how old are y'all if y'all don't mind me asking? 18? 15. 15. 15. You see that? Ecclesiastes 12 and 4. Ecclesiastes 12 verse 4. Let me get this verse in Psalms 38 and 18. Huh. It's the book of Psalms chapter 38 and verse 18. For I will declare my iniquity. I will do what? For I, I will declare, declare my iniquity. iniquity. So first you have to declare your iniquity. Iniquity is sin. When you break the law, statutes, and commandments, you find yourself in sin, man. Like what? Eating pork. That's a sin. You can't do that, man. Eating uh, uh, um, things that come out the water that don't have uh, fins and scales is a sin. Getting tattoos is a sin, man. Fornicating with all of these women is a sin. Having unlawful, unmarital, uh, uh, immoral sex, man. Breaking the Sabbath day is a sin. That's uh -huh. right. So you have to confess that to the Most High. Read. I will be sorry for my sin. And you have to be sorry for your sin. And you turn away from it. You confess that sin and leave it behind, man. Give me Leviticus, let's find out. Give me Leviticus chapter 19. Give me Jeremiah chapter 10 and 1. All right, let's find out. Give me 1 Corinthians chapter 3 and 16. All right, what did the most I say about these things? Huh? Right? Leviticus 19. 
28. Leviticus chapter 19 and verse 28. Right? Ye shall not make any cuttings in your flesh. You can't cut yourself. For the dead, nor print any marks upon you. Nor what? Nor no print, print any marks upon, upon you. you. Read it again. Nor no print, print any marks, marks upon, upon you. I am the Lord. There you have it. You can't print anything on you. No tattoos, right. no henna, no no nothing, man. No getting blessed right there. Like we say, the clouds and the stars, man, on your chest. The damn dice right there. They're going to get the dice and the damn mask. Oh, you can't do none of that, man. Yeah, prayer hands, right? Uh, 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 rest in peace, Nana, 1936, 19, 2005. You can't do that, man. Right? A damn cross on your back. You can't do that. That's a sin. Y'all got tattoos? Yeah. Brothers and y'all got tattoos? Uh, uh, see that? These brothers said, yeah, they got tattoos. Now, what does that mean? Does that mean, well, I said we just gonna keep getting them? Nah. Brothers that got, what y'all do, brothers? Repent. Repent. The brothers repent, man. Again. This brother never got another tattoo ever again, man. All these brothers, man. Right. They ain't never getting uh, that one more tattoo, man. Right. Once they found out who we was and we're chosen and that your body's not your own but it belongs to the most high, they said, I would never do that again, man. That's right. They never got no more tattoos. That's right. Right? Because you're a special people, man. That's right. Right? That's right. And your body belongs to your Hawabashi Yahweh man. That's right. It's not your own. Brother, how would you feel if 